duper fly, super duper fly, super duper fly. Me, I'm super fly, super duper fly, super duper fly. Me, I'm super fly. Hey, party people! Welcome back to my channel, the Chan Chan. Um, it's your girl Cheyenne, aka Shyly Me. It's actually not aka Shyly Me, but that's just been my handle since I started social media back in 2014. So it stuck, and I don't think I ever explained what that means. Shyly Me basically just means shy, and then like my name, shy. Well, my full name is Cheyenne, but my name is Shy and then the word Shy. So I'm just like, oh, Shyly Me, because my name is Shy and I'm a shy person. Okay, I don't know why I have to explain that, but I just did. I'm just gonna like take you through me cleaning out my closet. And guys, I've been having to do this for the longest time, figure out what stuff I'm gonna keep and what stuff I'm gonna send to Depop and like what stuff I'm just gonna give away. But thank you guys for joining me on this journey because I feel like if I'm showing myself doing these things, ooh, it's not right now. If I'm showing myself doing these things, I'll actually do it. Ooh, okay, these ones, active wear pants. Remember when these used to be so in? I don't know, even like for like athletes and stuff, I remember in high school, everybody wanted a pair. Okay, so the thing is that I haven't worn this in forever, but I feel like, because I'm not, like active the way I used to be but I feel like these are a need what do you think oh my god it's bringing back so many memories yeah but I think it's a need even though it's like skinny I know skinny jeans are not in skinny legs aren't in anymore who knows it can make a comeback but I don't think I'd ever just wear this as athleisure wear I definitely only wear it to the gym but we'll keep her because she's practical and she was expensive oh my gosh this was like pair of pants I got from Zara I literally begged my mom to get these for me remember when coulets were so in or quallets coulet coulet or quallet coulet yeah you know what I'm gonna I'm gonna put these on for y'all these are still mad cute but they don't fit me like you know they're supposed to be really breezy and like stuff that's definitely not what's happening here definitely not breezy but I feel like she's really cute. I'm, I'm getting really, I feel like I'd wear this if I was going to like a baby shower or like church or something. It's really a church fit. Should I keep it? I don't know. I feel like I won't wear it. I feel like I won't wear it. So I'm just gonna, for now, we're gonna put it in I don't know. Okay, we'll do that. Oh, we have this jacket. I got this from Old Navy when these like types of jean jackets were really in. I feel like I like the corduroy versions more. This is supposed to be a men's medium. It fits like a little boy's. This is a medium. I think I definitely got a little boy's instead or like the team boy's because like how is this a man's medium? Unless I'm just built different. Which I probably am because this was definitely in the men's section. But I remember even when I purchased it, whether um, it was the right size or not. And I think I'm done with this. It is going into the Depop pile. Oh my God, these I got recently. These are the perfect brown pants. Like, they're so good if you're into that brown aesthetic. I actually love these pants, but I can't keep them because they technically don't fit me. Yeah. I was pushing it when I got these. So they're like low rise, almost like a dress pant kind of thing. And they're like kind of like a flare, but like not an intense flare, like a reasonable flare. And they're low rise and like they fit, really fitted. But like the thing is that my butt doesn't fit into it, so it's literally my butt crack is just out on display. And then, like, my little, you know, area in the front there is also, like, too fat for the pants. So, uh, it's on display as well. So, this will be on my Depop if anybody wants it. I think these are really cute and worth it. Oh, they're a little long for me. Like, I'm 5'4", and I literally have to fold them up 
once or twice. I think once. So if you're taller, I think these will be good for the five seven up girlies. Ooh, these are my like sensible skinny jeans. I literally kept these skinny jeans around just for work purposes. And I'm thinking I should still keep them around. And they, I find, okay, although I hate skinny jeans, I feel like they're so appropriate for the office. I don't know why. Am I like losing my mind? Am I making that up? Let me know if you feel the same way. Okay, because like, I don't get it. Oh, so, wait. I think I should keep it on the maybe pile? Maybe pile. Maybe, because we don't know. We might revisit those. <laughs> Deadass look like my mother. Anyways, ignore this messy ass kitchen. I'm gonna tackle that. But I just wanted to say good morning because it's still morning. Wow. It is Saturday, May 15th, I think. I hope. I'll double check. And yeah, I just got some oatmeal on the stove that I just made. It's probably nasty. I like my oatmeal kind of firm, or really firm, I should say. I've been working on some branded content. Yo, this is intense. And I did my first kind of like PR email. I got the help of my friend, Alyssa. She's like the best. She's the bomb.com. And literally at this point, I think she should start doing tips and tricks on how she manages the influencer life. And yeah, just helping your girl out love that for me i just love it when girls help girls because that's the way it should be anyway let me eat my oatmeal and then later my friend kayla is coming over i think you guys have met kayla if not she's on my socials um she's a ray of sunshine and breath of fresh air love that girl and uh she's coming over to do help me out with my hair gonna get some braids in just because i don't like taking care of my hair and I'm after these braids, I'm gonna actually take care of my hair. I found some really nice natural hair regimens that I'm going to follow. And now that it's summer, I get to leave my hair out longer. And this has become a long ass rant about hair and oatmeal that isn't necessary. So I'm just gonna cut to the B-roll. Five, six, seven, eight. I didn't put as much sugar as I thought I did, which is kind of sad, but we move. Health is wealth, and I gotta shut down my sugar intake anyways. See you in a bit. I'm gonna eat this for some more time. <laughs> Hi, lovelies. You guys haven't seen me in a while. I'm actually cleaning up because the house is just a travesty. I think I mentioned that earlier and it's Saturday and back in the day Saturdays is where I did the when I when I did the cleaning. Not where I did the cleaning. I did the cleaning in the home. Uh, but you know just African things. I even look like a mother. Just oh look at my arms. I gotta get back into shape. And like, I'm not even eating like that bad or whatever. It's just the extremities, okay? And I'm perpetually bloated also, which I hate. And I have boobs now, I'm not used to that. Don't think I'm a boob girl. Not a fan. <laughs> Maybe I'm not a fan because my clothes just don't fit. And that's probably just that. Just on my housewife tip. What do you guys, would you guys be a housewife or would you guys want a house husband or like both parties are working? But I personally can't work and clean. That's what, it makes sense why cleaning is done generally on the weekend. I mean like if you, the people you live with and the children you have are tidy, you've taught them how to like upkeep, 
with your shiznits, you should have no problem, I guess, maintaining a healthy home, a clean home, a happy home. Anyways, yeah, as you can notice, I have two different earrings going on because I had the same earring, this earring, and this ear, but then I think it was too tight, so my ear started getting infected. Yeah, and nobody wants that. So I just have like a random looser fitting earring in here so my ear hole can breathe, I guess, which makes no sense because it's been healed. Sorry, one second. Just my video. Yeah. She just doesn't understand. Okay, sorry, I'm cleaning. And why are there so many air forces in the home? Like, you think one for each different person. No, these are some cases Air Forces for the same people. Is it, I'm sorry, is it that big of a deal to have crispy white forces? Like, is it really? Like, I don't, I guess, but at the same time, these are expensive shoes, okay? Especially if you're, you don't wear a kid size. These are like a hundred plus dollars and you're buying the same shoe over and over again like every few months or once a year. I, I, I personally don't get it. Mine are dusty AF. So, I mean, they have the beater pair and then the ones that they go out with. And I just think this is such a funny concept. No, I mean, I get it, but at the same time, you beat up a cheaper shoe, you know? That's just how I feel about it. Hey guys, um... Kayla's here. This is the fit for right now. We're just quickly going to grab some Starbies. Uh, after that, she's gonna proceed to braid my hair and I'm dropping off my little sister because apparently she's grown and she's going to Toronto, hang out with her friends. They want Korean corn dogs. So I'm just enabling that behavior apparently. Check the fit, fit check, fit check. Don't watch my toes too much like i have nail polish that has yet to come off but this is what we're doing yeah kayla's having a meltdown because she got some shit from zara yeah them. yeah i got this top from zara and i was like oh it's so cute i would love to wear it it looked great the quality online looked great but here in person it is doing paper towel <laughs> and it was 40 dollars, and i think that's a negative Marina, are you going to be buying my Starbucks today? Woo! I don't think they'll do it for you, but if you think so... How are you going to, are you going to move that and start it? Oh my god. Guys, BRB. No. BRB. I'm not good at this. Okay, I'm not good at this. Kayla, stop it. I get it. You have a lot of besties that vlog, but I'm new to this. <laughs> my girl is going to start. She She's resting. She's resting the camera on this. On the Prindle. <laughs> on the Prindle. Oh my and my girl's like, oh, let me just start it up. The whole thing would drop. What? What? And if you guys know the Prindle reference, that Sorry. means you watch. What's that show? Insert that show below so I know you're yeah, actually. I'm trying to remember it. I remember it, but I How? I can't remember. Oh, yes. Okay, yes, yes. yeah. Life is Zach and Cody. If you're watching, insert that. <gasps> oh, my God. I was about to drive away, and Why I didn't so start hot? the car. It oh, is boy. quite hot. Let's get the ambiance going. Open Let's that moonroof, moon, bitch. Woo! <laughs> we are vibes, going vibes. Vibes. Sorry, no, a lot that's what we're doing. Actually, we're in a whole no, winter but coat. I she came in like a road man. Hey guys, the whole winter coat. <laughs> Me, arms are exposed. That is hilarious. I, I did Tap. I check for children? I did. I'm just kidding. I checked for children. I, I, we don't be doing the for the chin, the children, the children. <laughs> Hey baby loves, I'm in my washroom currently baby trying to loves. clean it up. <laughs> Wait, that's what they say in the circles. You lost the circle? No, <laughs> they say baby loves? Yeah. That's hilarious. But anyways, I'm trying to clean my washroom because my mom woke up and chose violence and started yelling at me. Um, so I'm doing that. Um, I would show you the process of me cleaning my washroom, but that would take so long. So I'm just going to show you a before. Sorry, it's like really dirty. Please don't judge me. Okay, before. That's just my natural hair on the sink there. Okay, before. Don't mind that. I needed the, what do you call it? 
we didn't use the proper spring paint primer so that's why that didn't stay i was supposed to actually scratch that off got lazy started didn't finish so yeah that's what we're dealing with might just coat it over might just say f it so there's that um yeah i'll update you in like two secs bye girly pops hey y'all back washroom is cleaned let me show you a quick little pan of a countertop real nice just to care of that oh my gosh if you guys don't have these i 10 out of 10 recommend they were a lot smaller than i thought they were but you know what i managed to do my best and fit everything i just put things at the bottom that i don't use that often just so it makes it easier for me more like um re-ups of supplies <sighs> my friends hate when i say re-up but like twos that haven't been opened yet I use that once I'm finished with the ones on top and I'll bring them out or like just stuff that I use like maybe once a month or twice a month. And then here I just have skincare and makeup. My sister doesn't use this washroom anymore. So I just decided to put all the hair care stuff on one side and then all my like needs, like daily needs. And then yeah, some skincare stuff at the bottom, but makeup's on the top because I don't know. I guess it just made more sense because of brushes and stuff. Um, but yeah, this is the setup. My ear is acting up, my ear piercing is acting up again. So I have my saline wash here, uh, saline wash here, easy access. What else? What else can I say to y'all? Um, yeah, oh, I'm going biking today hopefully uh, by the lake shore in the city so hopefully that turns out um other than that it's gonna be an easy breezy day i really hope i go so i have some footage for y'all as well as just you know it's a good time and it's a nice day to get active and get out there now that the weather is nicer oh also my braid up from yesterday let me show y'all real quick actually you know what? i'll show you after when i actually get ready for the day outfit of the day so this is basically what i'm gonna be wearing to ride a bicycle yep nothing too crazy oh and my friend oh yeah shout out to kayla kayla did my hair i just put it up right now because show a closer look at my hair i just put it up right now because we're going for bike rides and chill and it's like different color on each side so that's really cool imagine if my hair was that this would be so sick just not a chair. But yeah, this is me right now, currently. I hope you like. And if you don't, that's okay, because I like it. <laughs> hey, people. Finally on our way to um, Humber Bay Park, I think. Yes. And we're finally going to go ride those bicycles. Um, yeah, I got my halter top on. Well, it's my mom's old halter top, but it's been mine for a few years now, so that's what's up um yeah i'll just show you the views because i'm not driving today yay me and i can actually show you a little montage of getting there and then i'll show you the bike ride definitely not going to talk because i'll be heaving so yeah and i definitely can't film and ride a bike i'm not built like that i'm so sorry Oh, should I grab my tripod? Oh, Humber Bay Arch Bridge, perfect. Mm, no tripod. It's okay, it's a lot. We're asking for a lot here. Hey 
Okay, we just made it to Humber Bay Park. Ooh, guys, let me show you the views of this park because this section is kind of messy. And guys, I'm like really out of my comfort zone. I'm vlogging in Toronto for y'all. There are so many people around, okay? So you better love me and like this and comment to get me in the algorithm so I can continue doing this for you guys because guys, I'm shaking. My armpits are sweating. Haven't even hit the bikes yet, okay? Too high for me. <laughs> no, I just, too high. I'll just adjust it. Been here for like 10 seconds. Already ran into one ordeal. Um, my, the code worked for me, but it didn't work for my sister. So we're trying to figure that out. Um, I, so I just redock the bike. Because I'm pretty sure you have to dock everything at the same time. Are you sure it clicked? It locked? The bike? Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, just waiting in line to get that sorted. Now we're trying to figure out what to eat. My sister wants like specialty smoothies, but obviously it is Sunday and it's late. So I doubt there's gonna be any. So I was, I suggested Juicy Dumpling because I saw somebody had it and I'm like, oh, their food is so good. But if you want to drive, you can drive. So um, she's making me drive now. I'm so sad, but such is life. So I'll update you when we, decide on food arrangements it was so fun though oh i have to say such a good bike ride how long were we biking for like two hours well we it only took us 20 minutes to get back i know we really blew through that So I just finished ordering some juicy dumplings. My TikTok is gonna be trash because I low key forgot <laughs> to record some stuff, but that's because I took over the wheel. So it's kind of hard to record TikTok once you take over the wheel, but um, I hope it works out for me. Um, but yeah, I showed you a video of the place and then I'm gonna show you what we're eating while well, I'm eating and my sister's just gonna mooch off my food as she always does. Mm. Oh guys, got my sister on the camera right now. Just gotta tell y'all, what's it called? So yummy dumpling or so yummy yummy or yummy yummy du yummy yummy <laughs> dumpling? Yo, that was so hard. That was so hard. So friggin' good. Ten out of ten recommend. Where is this? This is on Richmond Street West. Ten out of ten recommend. That was the steamed one. I'm gonna try the fried one for y'all too. I didn't dip it in anything because I'm in the car and I don't want to make a mess. So we just go in as we go. I got the steamed mm. ones with pork and then I got the pan fried one, beef, shrimp, and chive. It's too hot. So fucking good though. <laughs> <laughs> it's too hot. That's Great. hilarious. Alright, it's done. Just came to jump in to say it is Sunday night. It is like 11 something, if I'm not mistaken. I hope this angle isn't as atrocious as I think it is because I literally can't see it. So we're really gambling out here, but you know, I like games. <laughs> no, that was so bad. This angle's probably atrocious. But you know what? Don't really want to change it. A lot has happened 
this week. Not to me in particular, but to someone I know. And I just, it just really has me thinking about life and about being present in people's lives. If you love them, be present in their lives. Show them you appreciate them. And also that, like, don't be too hard on yourself. And, like, show those you love love, you know? And maybe even those you don't know, show them love, you know? Just, like, take it easy on each other. I'm sorry if this is not making sense. Because, like, I'm, like, I don't know if I should elaborate or not elaborate. And, like, I've also judged some of my actions as well during this time and like I don't know sorry that's just a whole lot but my friend's mom passed and I hope she's okay I hope her family's okay more of the stories get out there enjoy life because it's not forever and be good to others because you never know when your last day is and you you want to make sure it was a good day with that with honestly everyone you've encountered you know so yeah i think that's my end piece anyways i'm so freaking tired i'm rambling don't even make sense but yeah i think i'm gonna end the vlog here and then like you know, put in my retainer, hot girl retainer moment. Yo, let me even show y'all my hot girl retainer moment. Yeah, I finished eating for the night. Did what I needed to do, wash out my mouth. Oh. Yeah, bitch. Hot girl retainer moment. Yeah, the lisp is real. Super friggin' real. Yo, when they first put the brackets... Okay, I'm not vlogging like this. This is just ridiculous. I'm gonna take these out. Because it's not that time of night yet. Oh, oh, fuck. I think I broke them. I'm gonna break them. Ah, got them. Ew, why am I showing you? It feels like I'm just flashing y'all my... Oh, gross, Cheyenne. Definitely not gonna rinse that off before I put that in my mouth. Definitely not gonna wipe the keyboard. I'm definitely going to put that back in there and pop it in later. I can lie and pretend and say, oh, yeah, I whipped down everything because I'm, like, so great and so clean and so ethical. But let's be real with ourselves. Before I leave, I'm going to leave you with some words of wisdom. First, drink your water. Two, wash your face. Three, enjoy your meals. Four, Get out and exercise. And five, don't stop being a hot girl. Bye.